Welcome back to another video. It's your boy Josh and Marty here, and today we're going to be talking about how you can become your own crypto bank. Now, this is probably one of our favorite things in crypto. It's actually becoming your own bank, having your own ownership, taking control over your own digital assets and NFT, and having true ownership with it. Now, in some previous videos, we talked about public and private keys. When you own your own bank account, you actually own the private keys. So you actually own all of these cryptocurrencies. We talked about before, if you leave your cryptocurrency on an exchange, you do not own it because you do not own the private key. This changes the game for you because you would actually own the private key whenever you send your digital assets over to this wallet. We're going to be storing our crypto using a Ledger Nano. Now, you can learn more about the Ledger Nano by going to www.cryptocashflow.com forward slash ledger. Now, when you hit this link right here, it will take you right over to the Ledger website. Now, one thing we do want to make sure that we say is you can get a Ledger on Amazon, but we do not recommend that because you're actually buying it from a third party. There's been some previous scams that came online that uh some people that bought from amazon the people that were like the suppliers like i guess they put a different recovery phase or something in there and wrapped it up again and they gave it to the customer and whenever the customer put the uh crypto on their ledger they kind of wiped it all off the ledger so they actually got scammed so with that being said we don't recommend going on amazon and buying it you should definitely buy it from the official website. And if you want to make sure that you're on the official website, you can go to www.cryptocashflow.com forward slash ledger. This is very important to make sure that you're on the official website because you do not want to be buying from any type of scam website or anything like that. So now we're here. Let's talk about this thing. So you can explore Web3 in one secured app. You can see this nice design here. It's literally showing you pretty much everything that's going on. You have an app on your phone and you also get a desktop app with it. And this app and desktop app are amazing. Let's be honest. Right. So you can track the cryptocurrency latest prices. It will show you all the crypto on there. We don't usually use this a lot. We like using, you know, other tools like coin market cap, but it's still on there. It's a nice feature to have. You can uh, expand your crypto knowledge on here. It has like a spot where you can learn more about crypto if there's more information that you're looking for. You can buy cryptocurrencies on here, which is pretty cool. And you can also sell cryptocurrency. So it's like you're, you kind of become your own exchange as well as a bank, right? You can swap cryptocurrencies. Let's just say you want to trade some Ethereum over to Bitcoin. You'll be able to do that from your ledger. You can earn rewards and grow your assets. So you can pretty much stake cryptocurrency. And for those that don't know what staking is at the moment, it's pretty much like passive income. You can put your cryptocurrency to work and it will start growing. It's like compounding rewards. You can manage over 500 coins and tokens on here. You can oversee your NFT collection. This is another really cool thing that you can actually secure your NFTs on your ledger. And of course, you have access to DeFi services, which is pretty cool. This is something that we can talk about later. But one thing I do want to mention, if you can see right here, that you can actually get a debit card with this. So if you wanted to spend your cryptocurrency like in a store, let's just say you wanted to go buy some groceries, that's actually possible. Which is pretty cool. That's some more mainstream stuff that it's moving towards. So it's good to have all these things, especially whenever you become your own crypto bank. You want these options. Right. You can store all your cryptos on here, of course. Right. A bunch of different cryptos. You can keep your NFT safe, just like we talked about. There is a desktop version and a mobile app. Now, we're going to be talking about which one you should get. All right. So we're over here at the Ledger shop and we're just going to look at a few of them. So they have over here hardware wallets. They have bundle and pack options. And then they have accessories to go with your uh, Nano. So we have two different options here. We have the Ledger Nano X and we also have the Ledger Nano S Plus. Now the difference between these two is just a few things. So the Ledger Nano X is one of the ones that we mainly use. It does come with Bluetooth capabilities and also is compatible with um, iOS devices too. And it also just has a few more features. It looks a little bit more cooler. 
So the Ledger Nano S Plus over here, you can see it has uh, buttons at the top there. It's a little bit smaller, not as big as the Ledger Nano. Um, it does not have that Bluetooth capability, and as you can see, it doesn't look like at this time anyway it's compatible uh, with iOS software. But some of the diff some of the comparisons between the two though is they can both hold up to 100 plus apps. These being like your cryptos and um, other things that you put on there. Uh, NFTs and DeFi, they can hold both of those, so NFTs and also your cryptocurrencies. And you can work both of these on Windows, Mac, and Android too. And iOS as well too for the Ledger Nano X specifically. And you can't do that on the Ledger Nano S Plus, just to reiterate that. Also, the price of that is $159.29 for the Legend Nano X, and the Nano is just a little bit cheaper, so it's about $84.46, and that is in USD. Some of the other cool things here that they didn't have before are some of the colors. So we have three different color options here. We have black, we have orange, if that's your favorite, and we also have purple. Um, over here on the Nano S Plus, you have a few more options. So black, we have orange, BTC orange, we have ice, we have deep sea blue, and then we have mystic white. So you have tons of options there. So down here, we also have some bundles and packs. So these are the ledgers that we just saw, but you can buy them in bundles instead of individuals. So they have the family pack X deal over there where you get three Nano Xs for the price of $426. Uh, and then they have another family pack over here for the Nano S Plus. Okay, and that's about $227 there. And then they have the Ledger Backup Pack, all right? So this is pretty cool because you can use one of these to, you know, use as just a wallet that you absolutely don't do anything with. You just store crypto on that. And then you can use this one where you may connect it to some other things. You know, you may buy, sell, and swap, and that's just how that goes. So you get a Nano X, and then you get a Nano S there. And then down here we have some accessories. So the Ledger OTG kit, these come with your Ledger, so you should have one already where you can just plug it up to the computer and then uh, be able to access your dashboard, the Ledger Live. They have the Crypto Still Capsule Solo, so with every single Ledger you actually get a 24 character seed phrase and they provide you papers to write that down uh, with your Ledger that you get. This is more of a more secure option because it's fireproof, it's actual steel, so you can put your crypto recovery phrase in there, seal it in a capsule, something like a time capsule, and then just come back to it uh, whenever you need it. They also have this option up here, we don't use this, the bill of fault, um, but they do have it there, just another way to store your private key. And then they have these swag packs, so little swivel packs, but as we showed you, you can get some different colors and variations in your ledger, so that's just an option. And then they have this cool guy here, so the Crypto Tag Zeus. So this is another way of storing your um, seed phrase inside of there, so that way it can't be damaged. You know, you know, God forbid this happens that you have a house fire or something like that, and those papers burn up. Well, you wouldn't be able to access your crypto anymore. Whereas with this option, if something were to happen, you know, a fire or something like that, your seed phrase would be protected. All right, so down here too, you know, they have some more information on already. On the Ledger 2, you know, if you needed help choosing devices, you could click there. But as we showed you, we have the Ledger Nano X and the Nano S Plus. Yes, perfect. Now, we're going to definitely recommend going for the Nano X. This is like our favorite one. You can get it in the color. And um, this just has been our best one. It's bigger. It has the Bluetooth capabilities and it has iOS. This is a, a big deal. We have this one as well, but we use it just for a backup, like a vault. You know, we're not... And we like it because it doesn't have the Bluetooth capabilities, and we want something that has a backup. You don't want all these crazy options. That's just our personal opinion, right? So it's really nice to have this one as a backup, and then we have this one as like kind of like our main one to go. And we do recommend that you get more than one because this is like having multiple bank accounts, right? What if something was to happen to one of your ledgers, you needed to transfer everything over to another one. It's good to have that on standby instead of having to go right back to the website and then wait who knows how long, like a week or two. And sometimes if they're sold out and they need to rebuild, like that is a, a case that could happen. You definitely do not want to be sweating bullets, right? And being paranoid that you have to get your cryptocurrency off of that ledger. So it's just really good to have multiple um, ledgers 
And that kind of brings us to that, you know, the pack that Josh was mentioning, having like a, a big pack. Now, you don't have to get this from the very beginning. You know, just throw that out there. This is something that you can build your way up to at least get one from the very beginning. But ideally, later down the road, you're going to want more than one. So it kind of makes these packs look very appealing to get it's like three of them right here. Uh, I, I love this one right here, the X pack. This one isn't bad at all because you get an X and then you get an S. So you can have your main one. You have the backup, right? So this is the one we would definitely get. You know, you can definitely check this out. Pick your color, what you want. You can you can see here, you know, frequently bought together. Someone bought a Legend Nano X and then the Steel Capsule to protect the recovery uh, phase. And that's very important because, like, like, you know, Josh was saying, what if a fire happened? You know, that's a worst case scenario right there. And that's your only emergency backup. You really want that protected. So you can go to the website to check out some things, you know, see what you like the best. Yeah, you have your all in one space for crypto and then you can make a decision based off that. OK, so we hope you got some value out of this video. Make sure you get a ledger as soon as you can, because this is your ownership. This is your bank account and it's going to be a extremely important for your crypto journey so we got hope you got some value out of this training and we'll see you in the next one peace